Okay, today I'll be walking you through our 2012 Carver 41 aft cabin motor yacht. Here she is. This is a brand new boat with full warranties. She has 315 Yanmar engines and a 9 kilowatt Yanmar generator. Nice big cockpit here. Great for hanging out on the water at water level or fishing. I already I really like this feature on a, on an aft cabin boat as well because it makes it much easier to load gear. On a normal aft cabin, as soon as you go aboard, you're up these stairs. On a boat like this, you can stack your gear here and feed it through this back door into the boat or leisurely take it up and in. It's secure here if you want to leave it here a while. You know, a normal aft cabin, you're climbing the side of Mount Everest as soon as you come aboard with all your gear in tow. So this is much nicer. Now this boat has underwater lights under this great big swim step here. Very cool at night. Um, here you have fuel fills for each tank on each side. And you have storage for dock lines and power lines here in the transom. You've got a step for easy boarding. And you have a courtesy light here. Um, this boat has a 10-year haul warranty, 5 years for blistering, and 2 years on all components. So that's a really nice warranty. Good thing to have. So on this level, we have a large couch. Um, I think you could fit probably 5-6 people on there. Either side, you have a door, just like any cockpit motor yacht. And that will lead you out to the front, where you have a layout pad nice walkways with handrails here. Now behind this door, if we close this door, you have a large storage area here. Going up to the bridge, you have courtesy lights here that you can turn on in the evening as you're headed up to the bridge. Clarion stereo controls, speakers here, automatic fire suppression, got a little sink, uh, wet bar, there's your ice maker seating here and then you have dual captain's chairs with bolsters here at the helm so that's really nice I like these because I have a really bad back and it's nice to sit up it puts your back in the right posture it's very comfortable so here we have digital engine monitoring systems we have split throttles shifters on one side uh, very classic design and throttles on the other we have bow and stern thrusters, and I can tell you from using these, these things are no weaklings. These are a really good set of thrusters, and they work really well. Um, what else? All your switches are here. And um, you notice you don't have any electronics on this boat. Uh, we will be putting electronics of your choice on the boat when you purchase it, and that will include autopilot, GPS, and radar. Okay, moving down into the salon. I like this design here where you have a, um, the first step is kind of a grill so you don't really get any water intrusion because it would go in this area, run away. If you're coming in with wet feet you can kind of shake off in this area. We still have the plastic on the carpet in this one. Okay, as you can see it's very light, very airy in here. No feelings of claustrophobia in this one. Over here we have our stereo system and you have an iPod hook in here. Nice large Toshiba television, I'd say that's 25 inches, and we have a DVD player as well. Here's your panel. It's going to have your uh, all your um, switches for the boat. And uh, you have a air conditioning control here, vents here. Um, here's a little write-up on the boat. Hold it there for a second so you can see that. Um, okay, nice comfortable sofa. Very good back support, it's very firm. Here in this area, your dinette. And uh, over here, your galley. Um, nice stainless steel sink, looks like it could use a little cleaning. And, um, you know, stainless steel fixtures. Cuisinart convection oven and grill. Um, here you have an induction grill, very nice um, coffee maker here large 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 fridge freezer combo and as we move forward this would be your day head here and uh, it can be accessed from either the VIP suite forward through this door or from the main cabin 
So here is your VIP. On this one, you would sleep this direction. It's very roomy. Um, you have your own television and DVD here, your own air conditioning vents, and that's controlled here. You have your lights and your air conditioning here. Storage under the bed, hanging locker here, and then you once again can access the the uh, shower and vacuum flush toilet here in this area. Okay, moving back to the master. We'll take one more quick look around here. Okay, so we go down these stairs. You have a sliding door here. And you have a full queen berth. Air conditioning and heating controls here. Clarion speaker system. Um, television here with DVD. Hanging locker here. Lots of storage in this area. And of course another hanging locker. I'd imagine this is for um, the ladies and the little one would be for the guy. That makes sense, huh? Here's your attachments for the onboard built-in vacuum cleaner that this boat has. And if you notice, you have 110 outlets here and here. So each of your cell phones can be plugged in. Very nice. Um, full head. Nice fixtures. And uh, there's a seat in there. Vacuum flush toilet. Mirrors, storage, storage under the sink, 110 outlet and vent, and there's a nice window in there, which I always like. Getting some natural light in there is never bad. Um, this cabin door locks as well as the other one. And a nice thing about this design is, see, I'm here, and my guest is way over there. It offers a lot of privacy. Um, you know, you're not going to hear a lot of noise in this, um, and it's just, you know, it's just really comfortable. You each have your own bathroom. It's on either end of the boat. It's a great design.